mind, dog, and I can't see. I'm trying to be what I'm destined. What it do, pet the gang? What it do? Back at it again. It's your boy Bezo. Um, I want to react today to to our round two. Round two picks. We had two people we picked in the second round. Um, I just want to get to it. And if you're new to the channel, y'all already know hit the subscribe button. I'll talk NBA and I'll talk Carolina Panthers. Uh, let's get into it. So round two. Friday we picked. Matos, Gross Matos, DN from Penn State, and we took the safety from, I don't correct, I think Southern Illinois, a D2 school, I, I don't know, Jeremy Chin. And hey, look, we already know that what Matt Rule is applying. Defense, 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 hard, strong, physical guys, and we got it both with safety, Chin, and Matos. Now, my honest opinion, I'm gonna give my honest opinion on both these picks, you know, they're not bad picks. I wish we would've went Jalen Johnson, cornerback, man, but it is what it is. You know, I'm just a fan, you know, I'm not a GM. <laughs> I'm not going on a trip, you know, but let's start off with Matos, the big DM from Penn State. We need that edge, man, you know what I'm saying? We need it. We got Brian Burns on one side, now we got Matos. Drafted Derrick Brown, big inside D tackle, now we got our big outside edge rusher, you know? And he looks like 6'6", maybe like 250. Uh, we got to replace Julius Peppers, man. Julius Peppers was a long time legend for us at DM, getting hella sack. So we're going to see what type of we're going to see what type of production we get from Matos. You know, so that's a big, big, big dude, and he come from a big school. So our D line is going to be big and nasty. We're going to get back to getting after the quarterback. We lost Mario Addison, we lost Jerry McCoy, Peppers, um, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera, Vernon Butler. So. Church, don't sleep on our D-line. We added my toe, so just imagine. Kawan Sher at D-tackle. Derrick Brown at D-tackle. Brian Burns at the end. Whew, flames right there. So we gonna get after the pass. Uh, I know our D-line is weak. We double down, and I like this pick. I see where Matt Rule's going. We're not gonna hit everything in one year, but I like it. And now Jeremy Chin. I didn't know who he was when we picked him. I was like, whoa, but. Looked at the highlight film uh, the, the, the NFL draft put up, and he looked like a baller. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, he looked like a safety, like going like four three. It put him, I don't know, man. This dude like he can fly around. He can play the ball. He's not scared to hit. You know, he like he just stump. He's just all over the field. Like man, he like he can stick tight ends, and he got speed, big, fast, about six three. And Panthers did their homework, and they got their safety. Now, I think we're gonna slide. Um, Trey Boston, the free safety, because I think Chin put him at strong. He looks like he's a good tackler, and he like he got some range to him. So I see where uh, Matt Rule is going. So I don't know where the Panthers are going to use Chin exactly, but I would put him at strong. Run support, and he got some range. He looks like the, the modern, typical safety, strong safety, you know? Look like a Harrison Smith out there. And, hey, we can get anything close to Harrison Smith. That's a win for us, you know? And then we got him in the second round. We traded up, so... Obviously, they did their homework on him, and he's a very, he was a very important player that the Panthers wanted, and we got him. So our defense is getting strong and physical. You know we're going up against Tampa Bay with Mike Evans and Gronk, and you know all, all these big dudes, Julio Jones, Michael Thomas. So we need some thumpers, and we need guys that can cover. So I like this uh, round two selection. I like it. Defense, 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 because our offense is it's pretty much set besides O line, but. Our offense is, you know, it's pretty much set. And quarterback, too, but we're going to give Teddy a chance. But it's lit. I, I like the uh, Matos and Jeremy Chen. I think they're going to bring a lot of hard-hitting big guys to our defense. And I'm liking it. Man. I'm liking it. Not a typical Ron Rivera players, but I'm liking the direction Matt Rule is going. But y'all let me know. Let me know in the comment section who y'all wanted. We prefer that us to get in the round two. Some people say we should have got a linebacker. Some people say we should have got a cornerback. There was a lot of good on the board in day two, but I, you know, y'all let me know in the comment section who we should have got. But it's lit though, man. I got to see our defense is already. And what Greg Hardy, Matos kind of reminds me. Greg Hardy was a good DM for us before all that crazy stuff was happening. And we beefing it up. That's all I can say. We beefing that defense up. More strong, athletic, physical guys, and we got it with these round two picks. But y'all let me know in the comment section how you feel about these two picks. Um, I'm, I'll, I'll probably leave some highlights. And, um, I'm going to leave some highlights after the video just so y'all can get, you know, aware. But, yeah, man, this is um, this is two hard-hitting players. And 
D-line and secondary. So we let Pepe Yang. Um, I'm going to react to some more of our picks. Y'all stay on the lookout. Subscribe to my channel. I'm out. It's your boy, Bezo.